Hey everyone, Chloe here and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, it's going to be a huge, long, well, not too long, but literally a huge video of me just trying and mostly failing to find any of the new fuzz mallows at Walmart. So I'm looking for Horace the Yeti and Bubba, of course. And I'm also looking for the new cliffs. Hopefully I will find them, you guys will see. And if not, well, I'm gonna keep looking, you guys, because I want the new cliffs so badly, so... Hit me up if you guys have them, I will do anything. So anyways, I'm super excited about today's video. There is a great outcome, so you guys have to stay tuned to see. And let's just jump right in, you guys. Mostly I was checking in my hometown, but then it coincided with all my travels and stuff, which you guys saw the first part of, anyways, part two coming soon. But let's just hop right into the video, you guys. Hopefully you guys will like it. All right, guys, so this video was about like three weeks of hunting compiled together. And there's still a few left which ones okay you guys first off i see this cockatiel it is so gorgeous i just wish it was in a smaller size but she is so cute oh my gosh look at the new fuzz mallows <gasps> a deer actually at this point i had no idea bubba was in this squad i was only looking for horace they better have that yeti they better have him This is when I found out Bubba was in this squad. I was here last night. This was not out. They have Palmer and the super cute fawn, but they don't have Fuzzy, Cow, or the Yeti. I'm going to cry. I missed Fuzzy Connor and now I'm missing Fuzzy Bubba. Are you kidding me? What? Not even the Yeti is in here. At least they have Don and Palmer. They're so cute. That is so sad. What? Well, the other Walmart I went to had nothing out yet, so hopefully I can find them there. Okay, a few new ones here as well, just like this one. This guy's a bit funky, but kind of cute. You guys always tell me that I always have the best luck, but I never have the best luck when it comes to the really rare ones because, well, besides Tolik, because I missed out on Alexi, I missed out on Fuzzy Connor, like, I missed out on all of them. All right, this one's new as well. Hmm. Man, I am bummed out that I miss them. Oh, I am so sad. The problem is they always put like the most sought after squish on top of these boxes, which is so annoying because that means it's so easy for resellers to just get literally every single one of them. That's probably what happened. Cause like I said, I was here last night. This was not here. So, man, Bubba and the yeti i still of course want palmer i wish he was not this color green but i love dawn i'll definitely pick her up one of these days all right i drove like 15 minutes to get to this other walmart the other one that i went to was to clear across town well this is a totally different town anyways let's sincerely hope that they have the fun smuggles all right this guy's new a pair um, this one, keeping it real, looks like they don't have any five inches left. All the way over here, I want to buy his lonesome. Okay, bird twin, he's so cute. This guy is adorable, but I don't want him. Well, it looks like I shouldn't have come here because there's no fuzz mallows. But there's bird twin, but I don't need him, I have him in an eight inch. He's so cute though. Look at him. What an icon. They have a flip mallow. Not much. Well, I think my best shot was that Walmart that we missed them at already. Because all the other ones were way further away and I can't check them as often as that other one. I swear I was there last night and nothing. I didn't even film last night because there wasn't even anything to film. Okay, well they have this squad, but this isn't the squad I'm looking for. This is the one with bird twin in it. Not sure why I didn't get a clip of the super cute blue and white spotted stingray, but you guys can see her in the background. She's actually really cute. These guys are not worth it. They're not worth the drive over. I'm pretty sure this is a new squad without anyone special. I don't think it's a Lexi squad or anything like that. Well, that is totally disappointing. All right, another Walmart. 
Well, certainly if I miss the Winco clips, Walmart will have the new clips out for me, right? Totally empty. Should have gotten more footage of it when they had them, but literally I was just mad that I missed it, that I didn't film much. But no clips, at least not in the seasonal section. So we'll check the end caps everywhere and the toy section. So they had them out last year and they were literally just like in the Play-Doh section. Literally in the Play-Doh section. Oh my God. Finally. Like literally, are you kidding? Oh my God. I am totally manifesting I find the clips this year. No clips. They do have one of the new fuzzy mallows left. Web. Web is actually adorable and I realized I never took time to actually show him in this video. So here's that time. He is so cute and seriously derpy. Kind of really adorable. He's pretty derpy looking. Be cute. Again, I have to check every crevice of the toy section because last year it was in the Play-Doh section. Another day, another Walmart. Should I try it? I have some dollars. Sadly, I never have luck really at the Walmart claw machines. The claw is so bad. No clips here and someone totally obliterated this. But fail on the clips. And of course no fuzzamallows, but we have one more Walmart to check tonight. Well, the claw is broken now, so let's go. Oh. Come on, give me him! Oh man. I want him. Alright, time to check the other Walmart. This one has not gotten the fuzzamallows yet, or the clips. To be fair, I just found out about the clips, so... I'm not sure when this one will get it. Also, that's the precariously placed mirror. Oh no, they had them. Not even the Yetis left. That is so sad, you guys. I checked here last night and there was nothing last night. Like, what? I'm so sad. I do still really want Dawn, but I will wait to get her. I'm going out of town tomorrow to check a different Walmart, so I hope they have them. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to hope one of my friends finds a Bubba for me. Why does this happen to me? Gosh, I just really hope they have them at that other Walmart because I missed Fuzzmallow Connor and now I miss Fuzzmallow Bubba. Are you kidding? And no clips. Not in this aisle either. So from what I can see, there's no clips yet, so. All right, I have like two bucks. I'm gonna try it. Give me luck. And no, it's in the worst position. Man, he's in like the worst spot. The clock can't get all the way here. I will win you one day, Connor. All right, so first Walmart was a fail. I'm going to the other two tonight. Oh my gosh, they put out a bunch of a squish, but Obviously, Bubba's gone. I've already checked this Walmart. They already got the fuzz mallows, as you can see. They have Palmer left. I want to get Dawn as well, but I'm still holding back because I don't know. Like, if I find Bubba and the Yeti, I want to get both, and that's going to be like $50, so I'm not going to get Dawn yet. Yeah, see, now you can see Dawn. She's so cute. The bummer is Squishmallows always puts the more rare ones on top. So then it's easier for all the resellers to just find all of them. Like they're not gonna be at the bottom because the ones at the bottom are like this guy. All right, they have nothing in the Squishmallow aisles except for this, but it just has that in there on sale because someone stole the mushroom. All right, you guys, let's check Walmart for the clips. All right, nothing, nothing yet. No clips! I'm not going to be able to check all my Walmarts every day because I'm going out of town in a couple days. So, I swear if they have them at every store while I'm gone, I will die. I will crucifix myself. But, uh, yeah. Like, it could be in here somewhere. I don't think they would stock the clips in this section, but I'm not sure. So many boxes. Well, I'm just going to grab a monster on my way out. All right, I didn't get anything but a monster to help me editing tonight. And now is the transition into traveling. So this Walmart is in Nevada right, now. guys. I've never been to this Walmart before. 
I just want the clips. I don't know if I will ever find them though. Fail, I think. No one good. <sighs> Let's see. I just want the clips, but I haven't seen any. Ugh. Okay, this guy's new, I think. There's the new 8 inches, which I already got the ones I want. Flip mallows. That guy. Oops. Sorry, girl. Um. mystery bags but they're the ones that they've been out for like two years these which i have both of them i already have a video up on it ah <sighs> fail i want the clips give me the clips well it's a fail for the clips at walmart i'm gonna check another walmart next to learning express today and then probably a couple smiths and hallmark and five below <laughs> a bunch of places so let's get to it oh my gosh wait a minute no way it's horse the yeti you guys my friend actually got me horse the yeti but that is crazy what what if i found bubba he was just randomly there oh my gosh he is adorable but i do already have him well at least i'm going to be getting him my friend is sending him to me but either way he's so cute and i can't believe he's the last one left like oh my gosh but no bubba and i don't see any of the Pokemon Squish or Bubba. Sadly, of course, no Bubba. Here is just an overview of him since I can't get him and review him. He is so gorgeous and his colors are amazing and I don't even have a classic horse so now I will have the fuzzy version once my friend sends him over. He's so soft and beautiful. Look at him! Again, I'm not going to get him since I already have him, technically, since my friend grabbed one for me. But he's so cute, and I loved to see him. But yeah, also, I am feeling better. It's the day after my seizure, and I feel fine. I don't know what happened. Goodbye, my sweet cutie. I hope he finds a lovely home. And I still need to get Dawn. I never got her. I need to get Palmer as well, but I'm still going to wait on them. But look how cute he is. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, why are there so many of her? There's way too many of her, that is crazy. <laughs> the belly is so adorable, I love her. So cute. Well, it was a fail for the clips though. Alright you guys, we're at another Walmart. This is the one next to Learning Express. It's the new squad. That one is so cute. And that one. Oh my gosh, this means that Donkey is going to be in the claw machine soon. I want the clips. Oh look, it's the miraculous thing. And sadly, I can't find a box with them. Alright, I see these guys and these ones who I've already seen, but they're so cute. Definitely adorable. And I actually did miss my chance to get a little Amy. I found it! Let's hope I find something good. Sadly, they just have the old Fuzzballos. A few Bum Bums. Ooh, they do have Disney. Oh! A non-Halloween Sally. That's kind of cute. I, I do have Sally already. This guy who I have. Who is that? Oh, they're the axolotls, I think. Well, that is a fail. No clips and no fuzzy bubba. All right, you guys, we're at Walmart. Let's check for the clips or the fuzz mallows. All right, you guys, we're running out of places to check here, but there is a Walmart, so let's hope they have the clips. Oh my gosh. All right, they have a couple squish up there, as you can see. Nothing to really write home about. Anyone else down here? Doesn't look like it. Couple squish. This is a mango. Oh, an apple. 
right, you guys. No clips, at least not in the front area. I'm not sure if they're always supposed to be only in that front area or if some Walmarts will stock them the toys. But now I have to find what the toys are. I also actually need Lana Del Rey's new album, but I'll get that at Target because usually the Target ones have like a cool poster attached. All right, no one really special here. Yeah, not much. This one's cute. I still love this one, but if I'm going to get her, I want her in like a five inch. She is way too big, especially since I already bought a 12 inch and a 16 inch today. Um, you guys, so there's Horace, right? Look who is right here. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? Fuzzy Bubba! Oh my gosh, but the one thing, this one has like, I don't really like the spots. It seems like it's missing one right here. But oh my gosh, how much are these? It doesn't even say. But oh my gosh, and Horace. My friend already grabbed me one, so I'm not gonna get Horace. But oh my gosh. Lots of Horace, wow. Like, how was mine sold out of Horace? There's so many here. Looks to be the only cow they have. Oh, this one. That's pretty cute. I don't know if I saw him before. I still want him. I still want Dawn. I really want her. But, yeah, I don't think there's any more Bubba. So we have to make do with the spot choice. Oh, no. Okay. See you guys, and this is why I always have better luck out of town. Because, I mean, look at this. Well, I'm glad I found Bubba, but I really wish I found the clips because I think that is harder to find. But they don't have any clips, none of the new 7 inches that I can see. They have this little cutie left. Bum bums, I still kind of want the fireplace. Yeah, the last Bubba, should I get him? I don't know, the spots like aren't my favorite but it's Bubba so I don't know I've never found Bubba in person before oh my gosh you guys today is such a great day I found 12 inch fuzzy Bubba and wow I still can't believe it he's the last one I had to contact my friend though because they had an extra one for a friend who I was going to take and now we'll have an extra one again because I found this one but I'm going to see how much it is because I'm not sure I don't remember I think it's like 15 to 20 I'm not sure this walmart is definitely amazing that's why i love squish hunting out of town because my town always gets like bombarded by resellers especially this guy if you guys saw i literally went the day they stocked and there was no horse of bubba left and you guys saw how many horse was left in that box like all right you guys so here they all are i still cannot believe i got the last bubba that is crazy again i wish i got a better spot pattern but it is what it is. Okay, I'm going to get him. Now, where is the Dane price scanner? You guys, like, I don't know how much he is. And one cute little unicorn in here. Otherwise, nothing else, but I cannot believe he was here. Oh, I guess you can't check out here. Guess I have to go here. These are so different, what the heck? You guys, this is unreal. I can't believe I found him. So the 12 inch fuzz mallows are about $16 roughly, not including tax. I am so happy, oh my gosh. You guys should definitely like this video. I just donated, you're welcome people. All right, you guys, we're home and we found Bubba. Holy crap, I did not think I would find him. He was the last one also, which was crazy, you guys. And you know, he doesn't have the best spots. It's okay. He's cute, but he's really bald in that one little white area. But I'm super excited that I was actually able to find him for you guys. It's so much more fun to find him in person. My friend actually eventually, like today, found Bubba. So if I didn't find him, she would have gotten him for me. But again, it's more fun to find him in person. Mostly so I can film for you guys. But it's just more fun. Anyways, let's get into the haul and review. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Also, there's a couple clips that I cut out from this video so you guys have to stay tuned to see those in future walmart squish hunts as well as um the second and third and fourth part of the travel vlog coming soon so make sure to subscribe for that and let's get into the review 
Okay guys, so here is my haul for today's video. Glorious Fuzzy Bubba, the last one that I could find and the only one that I could find. He is also the first Bubba I've ever found in person. The only other Bubba I have in my collection is the 8 inch from Five Below, which I had to buy online. I could also not find that one in person. So that makes this guy really special because I was actually able to find him myself. Again, I could have had my friend grab me one, but it's not as fun, you guys. It's so much fun doing it this way instead of just doing a squish opening. The only downside of finding the last Bubba was the fact that these guys had their own unique pattern, which means that sometimes you're gonna get a pattern like this one, which is missing like a spot. There should definitely be a spot right here. He looks super bald in that area. I don't know, some people might not take problem with it, but to me, it really bugs me. It might not others, but again, I am just so happy I was able to find him myself. He is so cute, and I was totally, honestly, about to give up because, you know, all my stores back home had them already, as you guys saw, and that was one of the last Walmarts I could check on my travels, and he was there. Oh my gosh, he is so gorgeous. He is a 12 inch, and he was only $17, I think. It was like 16 80 or something with tax or whatever but super cute and i'm super happy he's my first fuzzamalo cow i was not able to find the 16 inch connors during like i think it was like christmas time when they released them so that was such a bummer for me but the fact that i found him it's amazing so i'm super excited let's get into his bio you guys also i really like that it's this style of fuzzamalo and not the kind of like matted one that like for example, like Palmer is, he's more of the matted Fuzzamalo style. Which, I don't have a problem with that style, but I think this like really soft style works a lot better for Bubba. So, his colors are so gorgeous, you guys. Like a very muted blue-purple. Like a blueberry pea tea color. So it's like more of a bluey purple color, I don't know. But super adorable, you guys. The one thing, he does have a fuzzy tail. But it's not like a classic fuzzy tail, you know, like it's still not fuzzy. It doesn't have the like, you know what I'm talking about? As you can see, this is a fuzzy tail is what I mean. It's like a regular tail with a fuzzy end. This is like a regular fuzzy tail, if that makes sense. I still think this, there should be like a poof of fuzz at the end, if that makes any sense. So that is Bubba the new Fuzzamalos. I think this is like series three or four of the Fuzzamalos. Like, cause I know that there was like the food one and the first one that had the dragon in it. And then there was the cow one. And then, I don't know. Let me know down below what series this is. But I'm super excited. I did find Horace as you guys saw, but my friend is shipping him to me. And you know, I don't want to like get him knowing that she already has him for me. You know what I mean? So, I mean, I did the same with Bubba, but that's different because I really wanted to find Bubba for you guys, like, for the video. I will be getting Horace in a Squishmail unboxing video coming shortly, probably sometime this month. I am really excited for that video, so subscribe for that. But that was the review for Fuzzamalo Bubba. He is gorgeous. That one spot does bug me, of course, but you know what? It's okay. Um, it's fine. I just don't have to look at it even though it's really easy to. I love him so much. He is so adorable. All right, you guys, so that was the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. It was super fun. Going into this, I did not think I would find him, but I did, oh my gosh. He was the last one and he was waiting for me. Like, I can't believe it. He's so phenomenal and beautiful. I love him. Don't forget to leave a like and let me know down below if you guys managed to find Bubba as well. Um, super cute he's definitely worth it and they're only like 16 almost 17 dollars which is not a bad price so cute and don't forget to subscribe again to see like the upcoming second and third parts to my travel vlog and more walmart squish hunts coming soon because i am still looking for those clips you guys i did not find them i am so bummed and i will find them okay <laughs> see you guys in the next one bye